Splitting with a gap. With the split with gap tool we can split the wall into two separate walls but we can put a gap or a joint in between the two. So that joint can be anywhere from a sixteenth of an inch to an inch. So we want to go up to the modify tab and then we want to come over here to our split with a gap tool. Now we want to go down and pick where we want the, the gap to be, but keep in mind up in our options here is our joint gap. And so let's say I might want an eighth inch. Okay, so an eighth inch gap will go to 20 feet, and we split the gap and notice how the, it went a sixteenth on this side and a sixteenth on this side. So it split the gap in half on each side of the temporary dimension. When I hit escape, you'll see that my gap is right here. If I go into my 3D view, you can see then the gap. Okay. So split element with a gap ends up with a gap in between each adjoining wall then. So this is where we actually build two walls and we end up with a gap between them.